Hello everybody, welcome again to this channel. We are watching Manor Lords, it's a new indie game coming out. Let's take a look. Indie strategy game for PC, sale development, aims to combine organic medieval city building and real-time battles. Ooh, City building! A lot of people love the old school city building. Oh, you start out as a little welcome encampment. Makes sense. Manor Lords. Pre-alpha footage, by the way. Pre-alpha. So a introduce lot is going to be worked out. Some of the core mechanics of the game including regional development, trade, and military recruitment. Oh, that's always good. We need more workers here. It's basically... The map in Manor Lords It feels like Age of Empires. regions. Each region has its own resources, as well as a development tree. Oh, interesting. When you upgrade the residential buildings in the region, you get development points, which you can spend to unlock new development branches. Looks complicated enough. This means that different that would be regions fun. may specialize in different things. Some may be more optimized for farming. Ah, oh, okay. I mean, like in the real some world. For mining. Pretty much. Okay. And some will process the resources to make expensive goods, like shoes or clothing. That makes it very unique. I haven't seen one do that Depending lately. Maybe on I'm just the optimization not in it. of your production chains. The price of the goods will change, affecting the market attractiveness. Free merchants will travel more frequently oh. to towns that have rare and more affordable goods. Okay. These merchants are the only way to get wealth in the game. So you depend on them. Like, in the real world, you would have depended on merchants. The Lord's treasury, however, is split from the regional wealth. As the lord or lady, you must tax your towns and villages in order to get money for your personal endeavors there are different taxes you need to buy that yacht benefits for example the time you need to buy that yacht straight to the church but in return the church gives you influence oh that might be a good idea to put it in there then every so often the king gives out valuable rewards to the most influential lords on the map including new territories oh, okay. you can compliment or insult other lords via the diplomacy system to affect their <laughs> influence. Insult them all! Your mother smelled of elderberries. Your mother was a hamster. Your father smelled of elderberries. That's the correct one. In Manor Lords has been redesigned after some community feedback. It is now divided oh. into three unit categories. First oh, good. Of community feedback. The peasant militia. You can call to arms the peasants from your villages. They grab whatever improvised weapons they have and join the fight. This will hit your economy, and you'll need at least a couple of, of villages to form an army. If you want better militia, you must train them at the training camp or the archery range. The second that makes sense. of recruits are mercenaries. They cost silver. Very realistic. The last type is Lord's Retinue. This is a limited, heavily armored unit that you can customize to your liking. Oh, nice. Like personal guards type of thing. Yeah. Highly trained personal guards, pretty much like your own personal uh, army. Quite literally, your own personal army. Very nice. Thank you for joining in for this short preview of Manor Lord's gameplay systems. If you're interested in discussing the game, be sure to visit Manor Lords Discord and subreddit. See you all Dang. in the next video. This list now on Steam and Gog. Okay, yeah, well, they didn't have very much uh, about when it's going to be coming out. Nope. Nope, just which list on Steam and Gog. So that's it. This looks very interesting overall as as a game. Um, the mechanics look very interesting. It looks possibly for some people might be just too boring and too hard. Uh, some people really, really, really enjoy this type of stuff. It's kind of like Age of Empires a little bit. That kind of like city building and things like that. But way better graphics and way closer up. It just looks overall like it's going to be a fun time for anybody who wants to enjoy it. Thank you so much for being here. Once again, this is The Mad Salvi coming to you with Manor Lords in this case. The official gameplay overview trailer. Of course... Like in the in the like down below, comment down below, subscribe if you enjoy this and want to see more. 
appreciate each and every one of you staying with me and being with me on this channel. I really appreciate you all. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.